over the past few days, we have been releasing our head started landings turtles back into the Rouge National Urban Park. Uh, we've been doing this uh, for 11 years now, and we've been doing so to help rebuild the population. Unfortunately, there are as few as 10 known adult individuals in the park. What does head starting mean? Yes, yeah, so head starting is the process of captive rearing or captive raising of uh, individuals until they're past a kind of critical point in their life stage of predation. So unfortunately, very few turtle eggs that are laid out in the wild survive to be a mature adult, um, actually less than 1%, and giving them kind of the perfect conditions to hatch and to raise and to live up until they're about two years old. And so when we release them, they're about the size of a wild four to six year old turtle. So why does that happen that one who grows up here at the zoo is yes. bigger yes. by two years. Here, they're not having to, you know, um, search or hunt as much for their food. Their food is given to them and also giving them the perfect conditions so they always have lots of time to, to bask in the sunlight and help them grow. They also don't hibernate or brumate over the winter like the wild turtles, so they continue to grow for those extra few months. What has been the success rate of that? Our survival rates are quite good. Um, kind of averaged across all of the years, um, it's about 85% survival. Based on that information, um, we have predicted to have a population size between 250 and 300 individuals. We do monitor and track a subset of those individuals with radio telemetry. So we are able to monitor their movements and use their survival data as predictions for the population. Over the last 11 years, more than 700 Blandings turtles have been released through this program. In Toronto, Audra Brown, City News.